offering shrine. It's, not it's, it's really good. I mean, lucky because that's like, like I said, every stuff and especially those shrines occurring randomly. So we don't have any curse chest. Curse chest is giving us the most value. But the offering shrine always offering you your max level item. So, for example, uh, my level of the character is level 32. So as you can see right now on this legendary item on the right corner when I'm go going like down in the bottom we got the required level to where it's 29 but to get that item we need to be level 32 so actually I had the situation with the offering shrine I click it and offer me I was like gobsmacked like ah like what's going on guys offering offered me like only legendary items to highest item level I possibly can wear so in my case it's level 32 and uh, offer me legendary items so just choose this legendary item but I think is that usually you will get the yellow items here but you can roll unique items and the legendary items as well so which is really great so I'm just gonna press and uh, wish me luck I guess oh boy oh my god <laughs> Oh my god, I just rolled the legendary item, oh boy, I, was <laughs> I didn't expect that at all. I didn't expect that at all, I mean, because I just obviously I just gonna, uh, well I need to read that. And then I have to, I don't like this like when we have the uh, re rewards window, the bobs still are able to kill us. So just give me, give me a time, like 4 rings and the belt, 10 spell with belts, no, because uh, I'm the Imala web a character so spell damage it's not level 32 level 32 level 32 and level 32 as I said everything is high rolled to the legendary items oh my god 27% material resistance score 20 uh, no 26 elemental resistance 26 critical hit damage so this is what I'm looking for 7 11 frost damage added to the spells I'm not really using any spells 15 elemental damage 16 total resistance score 19 rage generation on hit so that's probably what I'm going to take, critical hit damage. Uh, but I have to read all other affixes. 8, 11 lightning damage added to the spells. 300 force shield. Okay, now we're talking. This is something like really crazy good. Spell casting spell speed and 13 critical hit damage. Yeah, I think this one because we have 300 force shield so it's like we can call this like 300 life and we got some material resistance score and we have critical hit damage this is like really crazy good and this is 26 critical hit damage can I press inventory no I can press the inventory the thing is I don't know I, I reckon I have the similar yellow rarity like it's a critical hit damage and that 79 frost damage added to the spells is like irrelevant, elemental damage kind of good. But overall, th that rate generation hit is probably good, like 20, but then overall it's like nothing really giving us. Like that 300 force shield, that's the thing I wanna go. So, oh my god, this is like the thing, I mean... I just show you the stuff and what we can obviously get from it because I think this is like really good tip for every new player, every person to understand the shrines because they usually what you will get over there is just the rare items, the offering shrine they are capped to your item level, to your level, to the character level. So one more time, this level, E, e level, item level is level 32, so they're not gonna be in the offering shrine until you're not going until you will get level 32 so if you are level 31 on the offering shrine you're not going to get legendary items you will get the best items for the level 31 which is probably like for example this is level 29 so you will get on the offering shrine level 29 e level items and they will be just all rare but um, right now i'm getting the legendary ones so yeah thank you very much guys for watching stay tuned for another video we just try to keep those tips and tricks and stuff the new stuff which i'm exploring by myself just as short as possible so will be much easier to handle for everybody and videos will be shorter so it's always better so like i said stay tuned for the another video and uh, thank you very much guys for watching and see you in the next one take care and bye bye hit that shit